What is up guys, welcome back to another web app video and today I do have another team that I have built. Just like my BPL team that I've built, I've decided to go out and build another one because I do have quite a few coins. I have 10,000 coins and I do have two teams, one of them being the BPL team that I did upload a couple of days ago and I do hope that you did enjoy that video. So I am bringing you another one of my full Colombian team. And guys, I just want to give you guys a quick tip whilst we're talking about making teams on the web app. What I would personally suggest as a quick tip to you guys is build some teams that are pretty good. They have good players in them, like good nationalities. Like the Colombians, they do have some quality players in it. That's why I decided to go with the Colombian nationality. And at the moment, many people don't really put their prices up for quite a lot. So I managed to get this team for very, very cheap indeed. So you'll be able to make a very, very good team out of this uh, nationality. And just go for the underrated nationalities that not many people are clocking onto. And you'll be able to make a decent team that you'll be able to take forward onto the pre-race or the game when it does come out and you'll be able to perform very well with it but we will be running over my Colombian team today and we'll start off with the goalkeeper and in goal we do have Ospina he does have 81 diving 70 handling 77 kicking and 82 reflexes and 72 positioning not the greatest stats but he is a 75 rated non-red gold he's the only gold Colombian goalkeeper I do believe that's why I do have him in the net but all in all he will probably serve me well when the game does come out and we'll now hop on over to the left back for the squad. And we do have Benitez. He is a silver. He isn't a rare. But he does have 83 pace. Great pace for the left back. And he does have 67 defending and 64 heading as well. And all of his other stats are hovering around the 60s area. So it does look like a quality player. And I did pick him up for 250 coins as you can see. For an 83 pace left back. Definitely worth the coins picking up for him. And now we'll move over to the main middle centre back and the main centre back for the team that I did pay quite a few coins for, and that is Zapata for AC Milan, Colombian again, 73 pace, but he does have 70, I mean 81 defending and 80 heading. Fantastic stats for him, and only 1,400 coins. I suppose that's not quite a lot, but he does look absolutely brilliant, especially with the 81 defending and 80 heading. Definitely looking forward to using him for this squad. And we will now move on over to the next centre-back. And we do have a silver, and he does have 81 pace. A silver centre-back with 81 pace, who is Colombian as well. That is a pretty decent player. And he does have 70 defending as well. So he's got 70 defending, and he does look like a quality, quality player. And once again, picked up for quite cheap. 600 coins, when I believe he was going for around 1,000 coins at the time. So I did pick him up for quite cheap compared to the others. And I'll be looking to make some profit on him, maybe. But he does look like a quality player, and I will be taking him forward into the pre-release of the game. And to finish off the back line in the right back slot, we do have Arias. And he does have 81 pace, uh, 71 dribbling, and 70 defending. Again, great defensive stats for this guy. He's a silver again, but I did pick him up very cheap, 250 coins. So bear that in mind, guys. You can pick up a quality team for very, very little coins. Just with nationalities and leagues that not many people will clock onto. So you'll be able to go onto the game with a decent team. And you will be able to rack up those wins. And maybe get yourself quite a nice record at, whilst at it as well. But now we'll move up the pitch once again to the CDM role. And we do have Kulia, I believe that is. I'm not too sure how to pronounce it. But he does have 76 pace. He is a silver. And he does have 68 defending and 61 heading. Pretty decent defensive stats and good pace on the card as well. So it does look like a quality player. And we'll move up the pitch once again into the left mid role. And in the left mid role, we do have the non-rare from Serie A and does play for Napoli. We do have Zuniga and he does have 88 pace. Great pace on this card. 77 passing, 82 dribbling and 73 defending and again I bet I picked him up for very cheap as you can see 800, I mean 450 coins for an 88 pace player that is absolutely fantastic and definitely worth picking up for a Serie A team I would say so myself and uh, it's a shame that he does have 66 shot because I'd like to take some long shots with him maybe but unfortunately he does have 60 shot, 66 shot which is quite a shame but nonetheless, looks like a quality player. We'll now move over to the right mid for the team, who I did I did have a different right mid. First of all, I had a silver right mid that only had around 77 pace. But I decided to upgrade to Quadrado, Quadrado, I believe that is. And he does have blistering pace at 93. Only 66 shot again, which is a shame. 76 passing and 87 dribbling. Fantastic stats for this guy, though. And I did pay 2,200 coins. So he's the most expensive player for this squad. But I can see him being worth the coins and working that right mid role very very well and now guys we'll move up 
the pitch once again into the center attack in mid roll and it is the guy that I did get in my starter pack who was a center forward but I've changed him back to a center attack in mid now and it is Moreno 83 pace 73 shooting 79 dribbling and this guy does also have five star skills and four star weak foot this guy's card looks absolutely fantastic and I can't wait to get my hands on it when the pre-release does come out and if you guys didn't know the pre-release does come out on the 23rd and that is if you are an EA season ticket holder so make sure to go out and grab the EA season ticket so you get the pre-release for the game and you can get on ultimate team and all the other features early but that is who I do have at the center attack and mid roll slot and I can be I believe that he's going to do very very well for me and I can't wait to get in game with him now to move up to the strike force for the team and these two look absolutely deadly I don't know why but I just have a feeling that they will be very very good this year as you can see they are both non-rare and they are 76 rated and 75 rated but first of all we do have backer he does have 81 pace I think I'm going to call him Chewy and he does have 74 shot as well and 74 dribbling and 70 heading does look like a quality player and as you can see once again picked up for very very little coins 350 coins paid for this guy and he does have great pace and great Great shooting and great dribbling and great heading for a non rare striker. And last year, you know how good uh, non rare strikers did play, so hopefully, they play as well this year. So, hopefully, Backer does a good job for me up front. And then to partner him in those roles, we do have Pavon. And I believe I used this guy once last year and he played absolutely fantastic for me. But he does have 85 pace, a 74 shooting and 78 dribbling. Looks like a quality player to partner Chewy up front. And he, I did only pay 450 coins once again, guys. So very, very cheap striker with 85 pace and definitely worth taking a look at for a couple of teams. So guys, I will tell you guys that this team does cost around 7,000 coins. And if you do have that amount of money on the web app, you might as well go out and build a team similar to this just because this nationality does contain a few very very good players and some very good non-rare players that you can pick up for very little coins and you will definitely enjoy playing with them on the game although I don't have no right to say that as I haven't played with this team on the game I just have a feeling that they will play very very well but guys, that is the team that I will be rocking with as, as well as my BPL team. So I do hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you have, maybe you could leave a like and a comment. That'd be absolutely fantastic. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, hit that subscribe button as I do post daily. And that would be absolutely amazing. And if you want to check the description for my second channel, my Twitter, my Facebook and my live stream to make sure to go and check all those links out. That would be absolutely fantastic. And I will check you guys next time for another video. Bye.